So the XG Me Horizon Ultra has now been out for a few months, and it's just as good as what it was before, but it has got even better. Not only are you still getting that incredible brightness, those beautiful, beautiful colors, and the incredible sharpness, but now you can purchase a stand, and it's the perfect accompaniment for this projector. It is super well made, it looks incredible, it's a piece of art in itself, and, well, I'm gonna show you a little bit more now. Don't forget to hit the red button to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up and click the notification bell to get my next video first. So the first thing that you may be asking is, will this work with other projectors? And the simple answer is yes, but there are a couple of conditions. If you've got a tripod style mount at the bottom of your projector and it's under 5.89 kilos or 13 pounds, and if you want to hide the power cable, then it's got a power lead long enough and a power brick which is the right size that fits in this space, well then yes, you can use it. Now you don't have to hide the power cable, but obviously it's a lot better if you do. And you do that simply by using this little device, which is a straw type device to feed the power cable up through this pole. It is actually pretty simple and I'll show you that in just a second. This is the base which attaches to the actual stand and then screws into the bottom of the projector. So first of all, you need to hide your power brick. Now for Horizon Ultra owners out there, you may need a different style power brick. If you've got power brick style one, which has got two of the wider nodules coming out of each lead, then you will need a new one, but you can just contact XGME support and they will provide you this free of charge. Once the power brick is in place, you just need to feed it through the lid to the actual stand and then leave that loose. The next job is going to be to thread that cable up through the pole. Now I did this manually and didn't end up using the straw type device which is included. All you need to do is prise the cable out of the top and then pull the rest of the power cable through so that you've got enough space to plug it in. The next thing you do is screw the base into the stand and that's just a little motion at the bottom there, and then you need to replace the lid, and pretty much you are then ready to go. And this is then what it looks like. Now the quality of this stand feels as good as it looks. It really does feel robust and it feels like it's just made brilliantly. There's a 30 centimeter rise and fall, which you can then adjust. So hopefully you'll get the absolute perfect position. And that's just a case of then tightening up. The next thing we need to do is to attach the actual projector. So we use the base plate, which has got the tripod style mount, and we're going to screw that into the bottom of the projector. So I've grabbed my Horizon Ultra, and literally it's a case of just feeding that into the bottom and then just screwing that up. Now this does weigh quite a lot, this projector, but as I said, that this stand will hold up to 13 pounds or 5.89 kilos. You just drop that on top and then underneath there's a little, almost like a quarter screw, which you just turn around and then it's locked in place. And that my friends is it. There may be a slight amount of wobble. There is some adjustment also in tilt with this projector, but it sits absolutely perfectly and it looks absolutely fantastic. What I really like is that there's plenty of space underneath where the air vents are so the projector can still breathe very easily. It's not gonna get too hot and overheat. It really is gonna look brilliant. So there's only one thing left to do and that's drop the big screen and get this thing fired up. Now, in my opinion, this type of stand is perfect if you're the type of person that doesn't necessarily have your projector in the same place all the time, moves it from room to room or indoors and outdoors, and you want to be able to just set it up quickly. With that quick gimbal release, it means that it only takes a few seconds, and you can adjust the actual tilt of the projector on the actual stand, so you will be able to get it in the perfect place. Now, obviously, the, with the projector, the XGME can operate at an angle, so it can fit to the side of a sofa or behind a unit, for instance, but it just means that you're freeing up space as well, so you don't need to have it on an actual surface. But I do have to say, with this thing looking so good, it almost deserves to be on display, but I know for most that won't necessarily be practical. Now, the aluminium is aerospace grade, and it really does feel like incredible quality. And the heavy but durable base has silicon pads underneath, so it won't damage any floor and still sits very level. Now, I do have to say I really love the fact that they've just included a standard tripod mount and a standard base so that this will be compatible with many, many other types of projectors out there. So if you're wanting to up your stakes in your setup and you're wanting arguably the best looking stand on the market, 
then check out the XGME Floor Stand Ultra. It's been designed for the Ultra, but it will work with a load of other projectors. That's it for this video, my friends. Thank you so much for watching. Any questions, please do leave them in the comments, and I will leave a link to this product in the description for you.